Audio Jungle Hello my people, how are you guys doing this afternoon? There's another bombshell that is thrown by um, judges that declared Tinumbu as the winner of presidential election. Now they are turning the table around and saying Peter B has been declared winner of the 2023 election as Tinumbu receives directive to resign. Can you imagine this? I love these people. Why didn't they say this before now? Why did they why are they waiting? What if okay? What if Tinubu's result was not forged? Would this have been said? Can you imagine? This set of desperate people who want to rule this country by force. They want to rule this country by force. That was why Tinubu deemed its feet to bribe the INEC chairman. Daniel Chairman was aware that Tinubu's result was forged, but he still went ahead to accept this um, certificate and bribe those judges to declare Tinubu as the winner of the election. I'm very much surprised. I don't know why did why these judges did not say this immediately after the result of Tinubu was announced. Why didn't they detect this? For it to know that there's something fishy. Well, I think more confusions will be out there very soon. Because 90% of Nigerians, they know that Bola Metinubu did not win the election. They know that Bola Metinubu did not win the election and they went ahead, still declared him as the president of this country. Now it's time for this mandate. Tinubu, um, uh, Peter we have said that he's going to take his mandate back. Now it's time for the mandate, the rightful owner of the mandate to be given back to the person to, to him. The person that stole the mandate sh should immediately release the mandate and return it back to the owner. Because who? The judge of all the earth has justified has justified. Yes. So, viewers, listeners, what is your take on this? Your comment concerning this news is very much appreciated. Let's go into the comment content of today's news. After reading out what the content is, I'm very much sure that you have what to see. Your comments will be needed and appreciated to the content of today's news. Amid the ongoing appeal before the Supreme Court, to invalidate the election of President Bola Metinubu's Babashiu Lawal, a former secretary to the government of the Federation, had overly claimed that Peter Obi of the Labour Party as the winner of the election, the presidential election in 2023, adding that Tinubu should resign and over and add over power to the rightful winner. Lawal, in an official statement released on Tuesday, disclosed that Atiku, the candidate representing the People's Democratic Party, secured the second position in the electoral race, while Bola Metinubu of the All Progressive Congress found himself in a distant, distant third place in the pool. He made the declaration even after all five members of the presidential election petition court in Abuja had some copy of weeks ago on anonymously affirmed Bola Metinubu as the validly elected president of Nigeria. In his statement, Lawan began by expressing reasons behind his restraint from engaging in contemporary political discussions following the electoral outcome of May 2023. This is as he cited two primary reasons for this deliberate pause. The first reason was his active involvement in the unfolding political drama, which necessitated a period of introspection and analysis of the data that underpinned the electoral result. The second reason was the 
onset of the reigning reason, demanding his focused, focused attention on the management of his farms, which constituted the lime chain pain of his livelihood. However, speaking on the election result, he said, My answer to the first inquiry is that, regardless of whatever I make or a court said in on or did, Bola Metinubu did not win the election. Right from the start of the campaign, Bola Metinubu knew that he was not going to win the election in a free and fair contest, so he decided to go by all means. Available factual as aggregated from several independent sources indicate that Peter Obi got the majority vote while Atiku came second. Bola, uh, Bola Metinubu came a distant third in the number of votes called. He also called on the Nigerian president directing him to resign as the president of the country and give more attention to his health. So viewers, my listeners, you have heard it all from the Aussie's mouth. What is your take on this? What would you have to say concerning? It's true. This is true. This is the basic truth. But Nigerian being untruthful turned our requirements to our mass suffering and evil mission. So I know that God would do the needful. God has heard the cry of Nigerians. And I'm very much sure that God will do everything perfectly. So viewers, drop your comment below the comment box. Let's know.